Hello everyone, Crystal Fisher here and welcome to the Spyro Edit 2 Head Bash Apocalypse Showcase and Spyro Edit Hacking Showcase. Let's get the fuck started. Oh, wait a minute. I don't have the cheat. I can't even do the cheat. Hold up. There we go. Circle, 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 square and... There we freaking go. Alright guys, we're about to have some serious, serious fun. This has been a long time coming. And you know what I've been thinking about? It. I've been thinking, well, you know, what a great idea this is. But why limit it to just one video? And before you think, oh, you know, you do want to do it for the views? No, no, my friends. No. I want to explore every single level in this game. And I don't want to put you through like a two-hour video. I'm going to put you through... Well, a shitload of it, an absolute shitload of it, but uh, separate, separated into worlds, and maybe even sub-levels depending on how big they're, depending on how long this, this shit takes. Look at this. All right, so I'm going to explain, or not even explain, but more like just show off just the absolute insanity that you can do. Now, that was only with two jumps. That was only two head bash apocalypses. It was only with two head bashes, two errant head bashes. Now, the trick is basically it implodes the ground and then the areas above it rise. So, for example, we can now get up here, right, basically through legitimate means. Ready? If we. Well, almost. Now we can. Look at that. We're up here. Just like it's nothing. We're just. We're up here. We're going around. This is incredibly wild. And what it actually does is it kind of breaks the, like, textures a little bit like you see like you can see like cracks in the ground like it actually sort of like stuffs with the foundation of the level a little bit um that must just be a i don't know a problem because of the fact that i don't know i mean i don't really know the technical fact probably because you, you're literally like muddling the geometry and like the collision you're just you're ruining you're ruining everything essentially with this we are ruining the game but look at fucking hell look they're up there oh my god oh my god that guy how the how did that guy get up there? Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Just... Oh my god. Alright, now actually, interestingly enough, I actually have the, um, the super flame thing because I'm like loading, I'm like playing a new game from like a completed file. So, yeah. That's what I'm gonna do. Now, if I had the super flame power up, I mean super fly power up, that's what I would like, I would love to uh, have a bit of fun. And what I'm thinking of doing as well is I'll probably inevitably end up maybe I'll do like Spyro 2 part and then Spyro 3 part and that kind of thing because only because um, the thing with Spyro 3 is that it's actually a lot harder to get out because and we're talking about the movie um, because in Spyro 2 you can obviously head bash uh, sorry no, yeah no shit you can head bash in Spyro 2 you can double jump and so you can sort of get out a lot easier whereas in uh, Spyro 3 you can't do that so therefore it's made like immensely more difficult um okay so you're like you know being up in here like you get, it's like way easier to get to this position jeez look at that holy crap just destroyed everything and he's like somehow magic you know that the whole point of this is like he's somehow that's like the keyword keyword somehow somehow this has happened all right let's you know what we're gonna do okay i'm gonna see if i can make this we'll see if i can somehow land on the thing and then head bash yes yes oh my god absolute destruction wait oh my we just crushed this thing like that jeez and look at how like Look at how high some of this shit goes up. Yeah. That is, that's, that's a, okay, let's get the hell out of here somehow if we can. All right, let's, let's go pollute this area. Now, in doing a lot of these like hacks, basically what can happen is you can actually implode the level so much to the point to where you just fall through the cracks. Now, Moneybags, you're a great guy, and you want me to charge a hundred. Let's just talk to him. What does he have to say? You can't do the bridge without paying. Oh, fuck off. Well, I actually can by two methods. The first one is I'm going to bring the motherfucking bridge to me, mate. All right? We're going to... Oh. Piss off, Zoe. 
yeah, okay, the bridge is now mine. So don't even try that shit with me. Secondly, if you don't want that to do that, I'm going to show you another thing. The bridge is almost here. We're just gonna head bash, whoa. How the hell did that happen? Whoa. Oh my God. Okay, well, let's, how the hell did that? Uh-oh. Now here's the one thing uh, you have to constantly do is probably lay down safe states to, to basically ensure that you don't freaking like get stuck and have to exit everything. All right, well, goodbye money bags. I've buried you in. I've basically Beaconsfield mined you. Um, and any Australian would get that reference. That was probably distasteful. That's referring to a uh, mine disaster where like these guys got caved in. Thankfully, two of the guys survived. One of them died in like the rock fall. Awful, awful stuff. Actually, fun. No, not fun fact at all. Not a fun fact at all. Rather, a fact, interesting fact, my dad, when he used to be a mining engineer, he went down to that very same mine. This story was very famous in Australia because they were trapped down there for two weeks. Just horrendous stuff. I believe the Beaconsfield Mine in Tasmania was closed down um, shortly after. But dad was like telling me like at the time, I was like 10 at the time, he was saying like even as even like when he was there, like you know, 20 years before, he said just how dangerous it was. So it's pretty scary. But anyway, money bags, he has been essentially caved in. And you know, I'm gonna try and cave him in for like the rest of the time. All right. Ooh. Uh, how about this? Oh, I got an idea. I've got a really good idea. All right, let me try and get up here because I want to crush. Damn it! I want to. I want to. Uh, I want to see if I can. Damn it! You sort of got to. Sort of got to flop up there a little bit like that. There you go. Ready? And, oh, <laughs> oh, look at that texture. Make it into a dome. All right, look at this. Look at how high it's going to be. <laughs> Holy shit. That's awesome. Oh, oh, oh. All right. what about this thing? Will it get buried? No, oh, whoa, oh shit. Look at that. This is, this is insane. In the membrane. Uh, okay. Well, we have to get, we've got to get the talisman at some point, don't we? Oh, that's hilarious. It just, it actually destroys that. Oh my God. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Okay, okay, I want to actually, okay, here's what I want to try out now, big time. Okay. I gotta do it, we gotta do it in time, that's the only problem. So we've got two there. What, that doesn't work, okay. Okay. Three out of six. Oh, so it's not, not actually hitting, you don't actually have to hit that thing, you just have to hit that there. Okay, that's four. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Okay. Let me save state it, just so I can possibly get out. Okay, there you go, five, and then six. Wait, 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 let me get out of here. Four, shit. It's like going too quick. Four, shit, it's all run out. And six. Six. Here we go. Oh, Gita. Oh, an imploded. That's pretty awesome, actually. All right, now let's get the hell out of here because, wait, let's bury you first, mate. Sorry, buddy. Oh, shit. Oh, okay, that did nothing. In fact, that actually helped him. All right, let's get out of here. Whoa, he just freaking warped up there. Can I do that? That'd be great. I'd love if, the Spyro Gods could install that uh, freaking software update on me. All right. Now, are we even going to be... Oh, my God. All right. Well, that's caved in. Okay. Let's... How the fuck are we going to... 
Uh oh, now here's the big, big problem that can actually lead to game overs. Whoa. Okay, somehow I got out. Okay. Oh my god, the only, like, one of the only bits of untouched. Oh shit. <laughs> oh. All right. Let me see if I can somehow maneuver my way out of here. All right. See if I can find him. There you go. I'm digging. It's like buried treasure. It's ropeless for the lizards. Oh my god. Talisman. Oh, I can still see it. Well, that's all that matters, you know? It doesn't matter if the guy's basically dead. Alright. Oh, there you go. Yes. Awesome. In Summer Forest. Which I'll skip. God, this is making me want to do it just a whole let's play again. I will be doing Spyro 2 Japanese at some point, probably a bit later. I, I was planning on doing it early, but now that Spyro Edit stuff's out, like, I might as well do that. I think it's more relevant, I guess. You know, like, it's sort of a bit more like it's entirely new. Um, okay. First things first, Glimmer. Goodbye. Thank you. I love imploding the portals like that, actually. And then I also love, yes, marking up all of the, like, tree shit here. There you go. Yes. Ah. Uh, uh, uh. Okay, I'm trapped. Uh oh, now I'm gonna fall through. Yep. There will be many a game over in this uh, in this part in this in this game because I'm gonna get caught in bits, right? So like that, for example. See, I'm stuffed because the warp point is like so glitched that I'm like lost. So okay, so for example, I'm gonna try to try and yep get it in time like that see and then to get in I'm gonna have to jump like that see I had because that's the only way I can like make it in so oh shit see and there we go warp like a sort of a, a, a blank patch of land oh shit okay well at least I'll make it in here come on come on uh oh not again okay let me somehow get the fuck out of here oh cool I love doing this actually you know what one cool thing is as well because you can actually there we go. See? Swimming the air is like really easy because it's like all mucked up. The water sort of stuff is all mucked up. So I want to see, if, I'm pretty sure there's no extra levels that we can swim in the air in, but it'd be so cool if we could. That's, that would be the dream. All right. Living the dream. Goodbye Colossus. Oh shit. Oh, see, look at that. Oh my goodness. Still on the edge here. That'll create another swimming in the air bit, inevitably. Oh, and money bags isn't there because I bloody cheated. I didn't need him. I didn't need that piece of shit. Now let's. I just want to see him. Like basically, we're gonna muck up the whole world here, right? And he still somehow makes it. Okay. So for example, there you go. So I like I like ruined him. Let's see if we if we ruin this one here. What? How will he make it to the next jump? Okay, so ready? You're a pretty good athlete. Okay. Talk to- oh shit. He might- I think I might have trapped him in his own little world. Okay, there you go. You look like you're pretty agile. Okay. Cool. Nice invisible nothing area. Not bad. Okay. Shit, how the hell do you do that? Re this jump's gonna be crazy. Ready? What the fuck was that? How did he do that? Wait, oh, and he comes back. Oh, shit. T to hover? Well, you can't hover to get over here. Now, ready? He's is he gonna come back? Is he gonna turn back? Is this where it's stuffed up? Here we go. Ready? And now look at this. The hardest leap of all. Or the easiest leap of all. And then he lands. So it must be the trigger point somewhere there. Very interesting. My, 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 my running shoes. First orb. We're going places. 
This is one hell of a journey of orb collection, 100%. This isn't even about a, this isn't even about head bash apocalypse. It's just about orbs. Oh, if only you could swim up here. All right. How about that? How about we? Impl how about we? Whoa. All right. So I'm gonna make sure you can't get back through that broken bridge. The Ripto may have broken the bridge. We've made sure you can't get back there. So it's like not even safety hazard anymore. In fact, we've actually helped him. All right. Okay. How about we implode this lovely area here? Let's let's uh, let's make sure. You know what we should do? This is what Ripto wishes he could do. He wishes he could head bash the fuck out of everything, and just make sure that there's never. Uh oh. I don't know what happened, but I think I broke everything. To like it just lagged out. All right. Now I need to get the fuck out of here. All right. Shit. At least, it, uh, yes. Okay, let's see if I can somehow make it over to the thing. No. Uh oh. Hey, it's like the uh, gulp skip. All right. Let's see if we can. No. Okay. I think we might be. Oh shit. Wrong bloody save state. All right. Well, we're back. Way back here. All right. I'm gonna break the bridge again. Oh my god. That's freaking great. I love how he actually just m made the bridge become like somewhat of a drawbridge. Look at that. All right, so now this is all this is all like untouched again because I was an idiot and got stuck. But let's just do it again. Oh, cool! What's that? Look at that! Oh, okay. Now if we go back in here. Uh oh. Oh, can we get up? No. It's like not even classing as water. It's very interesting. Okay, let me see if we can. There we go. Shit. Can we get up? Oh. Oh wow, the whole world's marked up. It, it's like I'm um it's like I'm in the um it's like I'm in the uh what's the word? Like other world like it's like I'm in like the I don't even know what the fuck I'm talking about at this point. Okay. It's like I'm in the underwater world. And no, I'm not talking about the... Uh, oh, shit. Uh, and no, I'm not talking about the uh, park that you can go to in the Sunshine Coast. Alright. Oh. Seriously, I think this may actually have to be like a couple levels per part because this is like re legitimately ridiculous. I am... Basically... Okay, see if we can make it up here through that gap there oh yes seriously it's like a real skill in platforming essentially like this has become like the like yeah um no what was i gonna say yeah like the, these are like there's so much to do that it it's just like no point it's like i think a world would actually be like an hour each i think i could just because i mean you guys having fun if you're not you know let me know if you think this is like a really shit idea but i'm freaking loving it i am loving it and like it'd be cool if we can get a bit more off topic and sort of Talk a bit of shit, have a bit of fun. Oh. And like have some sort of topics to discuss stuff, what we should talk about, like Spyro stuff. You know, as I just go absolutely ape on this. Okay. Let's swim in the air. Let's we need to that's what we need to do. We need to like Okay. Wait, actually. See if we can somehow do our own cool like swimming in the air bit. Okay, so now it should be easy to swim in the air. The water's here. Come on, can we, can we jump up? Should be able to. Ah, oh, damn it. Hmm. Interesting. There we go. All right. So this is sort of fucked up though, because it's like I'm like now like in a different sort of world. Like I don't know how to explain it. You'll see it in a minute. Like, see, we're like under the water, so it like classes me as under the water. So when I get like to a certain point, see through here, it's like it's all dark. It's like the colors are wrong. Yay! Now here's I can get out. Actually, this is thank you, thank you so much. Look at this. Oh, perfect. All right, so let's climb. Let's see what we can break up here. 
Skip, 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 skip. Frame limit off. Okay. So we've got the orb over here. How would it feel? What would happen to this? Oh, whoa. What? Why the fuck is the button there? What the hell? Holy shit. Was that an implosion and a half? Whoa. Okay, this is absolutely wild. I may have to climb up here in order to actually get into that other area. Oh, shit. All right, well, let's go through and let's try it. Uh-oh. Shit. Oh. Cool. But did I just destroy my own sunny beach? Wait, oh no. Uh-oh. I destroyed Sunny Beach, so now I can't even... Okay. <laughs> Alright, let's see if you know what I'm going to do. Holdeth the phoneth. I'm going to enter Aquary Towers. And then I'm going to come back in. So, like, for example, go in. Great. Awesome. Preview. Exit. Come back. And now it's back to normal. Oh, now. Can't get back. Oh, whatever are we to do? Well. Whoa. That was pretty weird. Is it like a force? For oh, shit. Game over. Oh, we're back here. Okay, well, this has been a very, very effective, effective, tremendous, the productive, um... I don't even know what it is. It. Oh shit. Oh my god. I can't, I can't even. Like, you know, you, like, the game stuffs up so much. You ruin so much. Even doing, like, little things like this feel like forever to get even back back to the main area because, like, you can't, like, you can't help it, right? You do these, these stupid hacks like this. And then you realize, like, oh, well, I've just, like, fucked myself. Like, I'm completely stuffed by doing this. Okay. There we go. Alright, so we've only got a little bit more of the level to hack, quote unquote. Um, for example, we could, uh, could we do here attraction, gem attraction. Yeah. Cometh to me, gemiths. Ready? I'm going to employ myself. Yep. Door open. Shit. Shit. Shit, even more. Okay. There we go. Okay. So, we've got this one more door here. Ready? Shit. Door's already open. Alright. Here we got a portal. With this portal open. Ready? I can go in. Wait. No. Okay, it's not, not high enough. Shit. Okay. Not enough. Need enough... Yes, just need just that slight bit so you can like jump up. Shit. Because if you don't, then you're like basically trapped in here. So like for example, wait. there we go. Somehow, miraculously get out. Now let's, let's break this. We can still get the gem. I mean, sorry, not the gem, the thing. Or... Whoa, dangerously close, look at that. Oh, we can still get out. Wow, I'm flying by the seat of me pants. Shit. And now I'm definitely stuck. All right, guys, uh, let's see. Maybe I might see if we can do just a bit more of the level. I'll see, I'll see if I can get out of here somehow. Can I? Wait. Can I, can I somehow, I need to somehow, yes, yes, that's exactly what I need. Every, every little, um, head bash that I can do, I'm slowly either getting myself in more danger or getting out of danger. And now I'm back in danger again. Yeah. 
Guys, I fucked the game up so much that my X button doesn't work and now circle is doing my jumping and gliding. I shit you not. Something is seriously wrong. And you know what? Oh, what the hell? Why the hell is R2 doing that? Guys, it's, I've been recording for 25 minutes just about. Now I have been. So, I thought I was going to be able to do one world per part. <laughs> guys, you guys are in, I don't know about you. Some of you may be very excited about this. The good news is... There is going to be a lot more of this. There is going to be an absolute shitload more. All right, guys, thank you for watching this first part. It's going to be wild. I'm going to be using more um, abilities in the next parts. Give me some suggestions. Please let me know what you want to see because, um, you know, like certain ideas that you have for levels, I'll write them down so I make sure I can include them because I'm, I'm sure we can screw things up to uh, such a crazy level. Anyway, guys, thank you very much for watching this first part. L keep on, uh, keep on Spyro hacking. Jeez, make sure. Download link to Spyro Edit is in the description, of course. Have fun. Do this yourself. Have a great time and have a good night and a good day or whatever time it is in your damn time zone. See you later. Dad's a lawyer. In fact, you're the only not lawyer in the family. You, you go back to my father. Do you tell him? I will see you in court. <laughs>